Hello, this is Almir at almirscorner.com. Today's video is Task Management Management System for Techies using Notepad++. Let me open Notepad++ over here. You can see on the left hand side I have a panel that's called Project Panel. You can enable that panel by going under View, Project, and Project Panel 1. So here within this Project Panel I created a workspace. And within the workspace I have a couple of projects. So the project that I'm going to focus on is the to-do project. Within this project I have working TXT file where I keep all my notes throughout the day. Then I have my to-do that uh, to my to-do file where I keep all my tasks and then there's a brainstorming file that I can use that you, that you can uh, use to your advantage at the beginning of the project when you're doing brainstorming. Let me focus on my to-do file here. Let me open it. You can see that it's saved with that .py extension. That means it's a Python file. The reason why it's saved as a Python file is because I can use the uh, Python's indentation system and together with Notepad++ Notepad++ to my advantage. Here within the file, I have a section inbox. This these are all. This is where I type all my incoming tasks, and then at the end, at the end of the day, I will review them categorize them and put them either under current or the backlog. Within the current here you can see that I have the following tasks and in the backlog I have these tasks here. Within the current it lets uh, this task provide a status report to my boss. I can expand it, look at the details, I can open, add some notes for example I know I'm still working on it. Today is February 22nd, Saturday and working on part C of the report. So now I can minimize it. So you can see how I'm using the indentation system to my advantage. I can expand and minimize the task and look at the details. There are shortcuts you can use. For example, Alt Shift 0 expands all the tasks and Alt 0 minimizes everything. If you cannot remember those shortcuts, you can go under View, Unfold All, or View fold all. Okay, let me now move on to brainstorming file. Brainstorming.py. I saved it. Let me open the demo version here. I saved it as a py file that's a Python file. And I'm going to use it to my advantage. You're at the beginning of the project. Let's assume you got some requirements and you're sitting down with your team and reviewing the requirements and breaking down the project into the details. And now you're creating category A, category B, category C. And now within the category A you might break it down into task 1, task 2, task 3. Within the category B you can break it into task 1, task 2 for example. And category C you break it into task 1 and task 2. So now you're going to move more detail into task 1 within the category A and you might provide like break it down into subtask A, subtask B, and the task 2 you're going to break down into subtask A, maybe 2A, subtask 2B. Now you can see how you can minimize and expand these sections. So if I use that shortcut, Alt Shift 0 is going to expand everything and Alt 0 minimizes it. So let me go back and expand everything. Now you can go into the details of each one of these items, provide the level of effort. And at the end you can enter, take all this information and put it into your choice of project management tool and track your project. Thank you very much. This is Almir at almirscorner.com.